Hello, I'm Danine Erasmus from Farmers Weekly. In this series, which we are doing in collaboration with the Maze Trust, we are speaking to some of the researchers and service providers um, that give some information, intelligence and data to the agricultural sector and the maize industries in particular that can help agribusinesses and farmers make important decisions on their farms and in their businesses. I'm speaking now to Makabo Matlu from the Agricultural Research Council where she is a researcher in soil science. Welcome and thank you for joining us. Okay, good morning Denin and thanks for having me. Um, if we can just start by you explaining just very briefly to those viewers who might not know what exactly is the Agricultural Research Council? Okay, the Agricultural Research Council is a premier agricultural research institution in South Africa. We derive our mandate from the Department of Science and Innovation and the Department of uh, Agriculture, Rural De Development and Land Reform. We have various uh, campuses across the country where we conduct research on various aspects of agriculture. And we work with partners uh, to improve the quality of life. I'm from the Institute for Soil Campus, which uh, focuses on soil climate and water. Mm -hmm. I work as a researcher and a soil scientist. I focus, my area of speciality is um, climate smart agriculture, sustainable land use and uh, food security, specifically focusing on the emerging small scale mm -hmm. farmers. Um, and in the study of climate smart agriculture, so one of the buzzwords in that field recently has been conservation agriculture specifically. Um, what does conservation agriculture mean and what are some of the principles involved in conservation agriculture? Okay, conservation agriculture is a resource saving technology which promotes uh, sustainable land use while at the same time improving soil quality. Over the past uh, couple of decades, it has uh, received increasing interest worldwide as well as, well as in South Africa. In response to the protection of natural resources in South Africa, the South African government has uh, introduced programs uh, that pro promote uh, sustainable land use programs such as the land care, which focus on the conservation of natural mm -hmm. resources while at the same time improving food security. And one of conservation agriculture is one of the programs which fall at the under uh, land care program. And then for more than uh, 20 years now, the Agricultural Research Council has been working with various government departments and the municipalities uh, uh, in implementing the conservation agriculture technology uh, across the country, specifically with the emerging farmers. And then the results uh, have been uh, a great success. For the soil quality has improved in the farms where we have been working with the emerging farmers. Uh, the household food security has also improved as well the, as the food security. And then the principles of conservation agriculture, which are defined by the Food and Agricultural Organization, uh, are three. And the, these principles should be applied simultaneously in the field. Mm -hmm. And the first principle is um, no till or, or minimum uh, soil disturbance. This is why you, we use the spe specified implement. We only reap where we are going to plant. And then the second principle is um, permanent soil cover, where after planting, after harvesting, we leave the crop residues on the soil surface and the soil must be covered with about 30% of the crop residues. Or another way of uh, covering the soil is by planting the cover crops. The third uh, principle, is the crop rotation or diversification. This is where you change uh, various crop. Maybe this year you plant maize, the next year you plant uh, uh, soybean. That way then you break the disease cycle and then you also improve uh, food, uh, the soil quality. And then uh, according to the information released by the Department of Agriculture, Rural Development and Land Reform in 2018, about 437 1,500 hectares of arable land is under CA in South Africa, which represents about 3.5% uh, 3, 3 of the crop land. And then the Department of Agriculture has also released uh, a draft uh, conservation agriculture policy, which aims to ensure that the agricultural systems are ecologically and economically sustainable, so, so as to improve uh, uh, food security and they're preserving the natural resource space. 
Makabo, thank you very much for joining us today and for sharing that information. I really look forward to speaking to you again at some point to learn more about these specific projects that you are implementing across the country. Okay, thank you so much for having me.